Welcome to the only climbing channel that doesn't feature parkour, boxers, or the world's strongest man. This week, we'll be talking about climbing, again, because that's what we talk about, but in particular, Shauna Coxey's climbing. Just over a year after giving birth, six months after double knee surgery, Shauna Coxey has just climbed two Font 8Bs in as many months. This officially makes Shauna Britain's strongest mum, and unofficially, Britain's strongest woman. There's only three other women, aside from Shauna, that have climbed Font 8B, none of whom have climbed them in the short space of time that it's taken Shauna. And those other women are Molly Thompson-Smith, Frances Bensley, and Mina Leslie Wojastik. And the scariest thing about Shauna is it feels like she's only just getting warmed up. And this is after everything that's happened in the last few years, be that knee surgery, childbirth, or lest we forget, the Tokyo Olympics. It feels like we're not far away from her reaching her previous high point of Font 8B+, back when she climbed the new baseline. And I think we all agree here at UKC that 8C is on the horizon. Going back to Shauna's most recent ascents, the first 8B was a repeat of Dan Varian's Font 8B flip flopper at the Bowderstone in the Lake District. This is a core and finger intensive board style problem. And knowing Dan Varian's grading, no soft touch either. Shauna told UKC, it feels so good. I guess I never really knew what to expect from my climbing during my postpartum journey. I knew I really wanted to be pushing into the hard grades again, but had no idea what my recovery from pregnancy and birth would be like, plus having double knee surgery. Just over a month later, Shauna went to Ogmore in South Wales and repeated Elliot Stevens' 8B Hydro. Hydro is a sit start to Solomon Campbell Dory's 8A The Fisherman. It climbs a stunning looking prow on sharp limestone edges all off a beach. Perfect place for the family. When we asked Shauna about climbing two Font 8Bs within a month, she had this slightly unexpected answer for us. So I nearly managed two in two days, but my power endurance let me down. I still feel like I'm lacking some beans as I'm still breastfeeding, which I love, but it's hard too. It's just so nice to feel confident enough to try these boulders and to be finding my fight again. I still feel like I have a lot of gains to make, which is exciting too. Perhaps the maddest thing of all is that Sean has been fitting these ascents in and around filming a series featuring her 50 top font sevens in the UK. The first of which you can see by clicking here. So since I was last on YouTube, quite a lot has happened. I've always been someone who likes to have a goal to work towards. And we came up with the idea to try and find the best 50 sevens in the UK. So graded, boulders graded from 7A to 70 plus. My foot popped. And try and go to loads of different places around the UK because I've not done much outdoor climbing with focusing so much in the UK. Trying to create a list that represents a lot of different styles and rocks and locations around the UK. It's great seeing Shauna back on form, and I suspect that we'll be reporting on her more within the coming months, which makes for a nice break from reporting about Will Bosey every week anyway. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.